y'all doing today, you know what I'm saying? Hope y'all taking care of y'all stuff today, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know what to do, you know what I'm saying? Like, share, and comment, smack that dope bell for me, baby, you heard me? And keep God first, always, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna let this video take off. I'm gonna play catch up at the end, baby, let's go. Mistress, people would say side chick. I'm not gonna say that, but mistress, we're going back and forth on Instagram. Now, this has been a debate for a while. Tim Anderson, of course, he is married to his wife of five years, and he has two kids with her. But recently, he did have a child with Deja, and people are calling Deja his mistress. Now, I guess Deja just didn't agree with that, and she decided to post a lot of receipts and pictures of her and Tim Anderson being together for the longest and through her pregnancy with his child in childbirth. Well, it looks like Bria, his wife, is still sticking to her husband. Regardless of what Deja is saying and posting, Bria is sticking to that's her husband and she is his wife, and they are just working on their marriage, even though it looks like he's working somewhere else and staying somewhere else, child. This beef all started off today with Bria posting some loving posts onto her Insta story of her and her husband, Tim Anderson. Anderson. Well, I guess a lot of people were getting on Deja after they seen that Bria was posting her husband. A lot of people are upset at Deja for allowing herself to be the side chick and to get pregnant by him. Let's just say allegedly because Deja is saying that she is not a side chick. Now, this had me wondering what Tim Anderson is telling Deja. What is he telling his wife for them to stick around? This is what Deja posted onto her Insta story. This is one of her posts. And she said what Tim Anderson told her. She said, he told me that he was not with her. It's only for the image. He's always stayed by himself since I've met him. Later on, when things got real, Deja decided to make her page private. And Bria decided to post this final post. This is what she said. A moment of authenticity. I know we're all on social media, but there's a distinction between the internet and real life. In real life, I am a mother and a wife. And she put wife in caps that cares about my family above anything else. My truth is that me and my husband are working on our marriage and I'm not interested in the internet games. I ask for everyone to respect my family's privacy, XO Miss Anderson. So she is definitely sticking by Tim Anderson and she's letting it be known that even though he is over there, I guess playing house with Deja, she is still working on her marriage with her husband, Tim Anderson, and she plans to still be with him, even though he has fathered another child outside of their marriage. I want to get into some of the comments that were left in the comment section under this post about this drama and i want to know what comment you guys agree with the most let's go ahead and get into this first person they said marriage is challenging and confusing at times as a married woman i can honestly say that sometimes in a situation you have no idea what to do but you think about your kids and what you've built with the person it's hard to throw that all away when you have history time and love involved it's not fair but it's life. this is unfortunate but we should respect her privacy celebrities lives are so public at times i know this hurts another person said everybody is speaking but his married ass doubt that's something that he actually will do or that he's interested in at this point another person said girl bye that man lied to you and god when he took those vows is given amina and tara for the kids at this point Another person said, your privacy. Y'all brought it on here, and now we're on episode two, season three of the whole drama. I'm so invested in this. Another person said that, I'm a wife. Got y'all all here staying in marriages where it's obvious disrespect, but you're a wife, though. Another person said, how do y'all think y'all grandparents and great-grandparents stay together <laughs> thick and thin till you know what do you part? Now, there is some people, obviously, right, in the comment you know section man. saying that this is normal. Oh, in a that marriage video, baby, and that these two you know actually can't get I'm through leave that the video situation. Up, you know There's people saying? saying that this is very Y'all disrespectful me, you know and under the vows you know of their marriage, no he is being very disrespectful you, 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 you. and Bria should leave in at way, this point. You know I want to know you guys' thoughts. In a way, let me go ahead. Nah. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what made this young lady think that she don't get recognition when you dealing with a married man. You feel me? You might got a child by this man now, but guess what? You still ain't going to be a recognition to this man because you know why? This man going to always choose his wife over you. I don't care what what day it is, what time it is. You feel what I'm saying? The bigger mistake that most people make in this world, right? When you got married women, you got married men, right? 
you shouldn't you should know better not step outside of your, your marriage. You feel what I'm saying? Because God don't like that. You feel what I'm saying? So you got to get accounted for that. You feel what I'm saying? But you know what I'm saying? God say for better, for worse. It don't matter if this dude went out and made a baby. You feel what I'm saying? Behind his wife's back, right? God say for better, for worse, right? Some women, they have the strength enough to stick by their marriage. You know what I'm saying? They don't want to divorce. You feel what I'm saying? Some of them follow God's laws. You know what I'm saying? They follow his guideline and everything. Some women, they just don't. You feel what I'm saying? But you get, but I be trying to speak to certain people on here like, look, here, let me tell you something. Anytime you're dealing with a married man, right? Don't never think this man going to leave you. If he do leave his wife for you, guess what? He going to do the same thing what he done to his wife. You feel me? So if you can't use common sense, you know what I'm saying? Don't let love, you know what I'm saying, blind you the way that you can't think like, hey, you know what I'm saying? If he did this to his wife, he going to do it to me. Because nine times out of ten, right, if he decide to do that, guess what? You're going to always have in the back of your mind, you're going to say, I wonder if he out there cheating. I wonder if he, you know what I'm saying, he did it to his wife, he don't done it to me. It's too late to think about that, though. You feel what I'm saying? Because you must find you don't tie the knot. You dig what I'm saying? Let me tell you something. I knew I figured, dude, he looked familiar. You feel what I'm saying? You know, I watch a lot of baseball, not baseball, but I, I be knowing, like, certain people that play baseball. You feel what I'm saying? But to, to me, my knowledge is this here, right? When a, if a man do it, he ain't going to be loyal to you. You feel what I'm saying? If he ain't loyal, loyal to his marriage, what make you think he going to be loyal to you? You feel what I'm saying? That go for a woman too. You feel me? If she over there across the other fence, what make you think that woman gonna be loyal to you? You feel what I'm saying? If she done it to her husband, and her husband don't know about she, you know what I'm saying, she stepping out the door, you know what I'm saying? What make you think she ain't gonna do it to you? You feel me? Anytime you mess with somebody, this I always think. You feel me? I don't care if you're shacking or whatever. If you take a woman from away from that man, right? Nine times out of ten, you feel what I'm saying? She gonna do the same to you. You know what I'm saying? Uh, either the uh, uh, the relationship not gonna make it because she messed around and left her husband for you. So guess what? God gonna make sure that you know what I'm saying. He ain't gonna let y'all marry. I mean, y'all relationship work. You feel what I'm saying? Cause God don't like no all that fornication stuff. You feel what I'm saying? So that's why certain. Uh, marriage don't work because people don't stand by God's laws, what he got written in that good book. You feel what I'm saying? If a lot of us follow God's law, you know what I'm saying? It'll be a lot of people right now still married. You feel what I'm saying? But it's up to you, you know what I'm saying, to have a good, strong mindset that, you know, hey, I ain't finna step outside of my wife. You feel what I'm saying? It's gonna be told up to you. You know what I'm saying? So you can have a baby out of red law. You feel what I'm saying? So most people don't know what God say. It's including me too. You know what I'm saying? I ain't talking about because I'm a married. Nah, I ain't never did nothing. But listen, listen to this here though, right? When when we out there shacking, doing wrong, right? You know what I'm saying? Now, I had to, to see this for myself too, right? Because I started listening, you know what I'm saying? You know, I listened to, you know what I'm saying, a lot of what one preaching. And then I already knew about it, right, too. So I'm like, man, so my kids, if you make baby out of red lock, right? You know what God called these kids? God called these kids a bastard. It's in that good book. I was like, man, so oh, my kids is one of them now. You feel what I'm saying? Because God letting us know that what he called our kids. But you find people get mad if you call their kid a bastard. But hey, God, you know what I'm saying? He said and he meant that. You feel what I'm saying? So you know what I'm saying, people, you know what I'm saying? These young ladies, some of the young ladies, man, think think a man gonna really, really be in love with you. You know what I'm saying? Use common sense. You feel what I'm saying? Don't have no dealings with no married man. And a man don't have no dealings with no married woman. Because I'm gonna tell you something. The relationship is not gonna work because you're gonna always have it in the back of your mind. Like, you know what I'm saying? I wonder if you out there cheating. You feel what I'm saying? Then right there gonna start confusion. Then right there, guess what? It ain't going to start, nobody ain't going to trust one another. You ain't going to trust that dude. You feel what I'm saying? And that dude ain't going to trust that woman. You feel me? 
You know what I'm saying? So you got to be really built for marriage. You feel what I'm saying? Marriage is not no, you know what I'm saying, like you can do like Shaq and like you go date this woman, you go date this woman. Really, y'all don't have no ties with each other because you know what I'm saying? Because y'all ain't, ain't signed on a piece of paper, you know what I'm saying, on the dollar line. You feel what I'm saying? And then y'all ain't standing standing on team, no business, what God say. You feel what I'm saying? So nine times a team, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It's always going to be people be doing, I mean, certain people make these little dummy moves and thinking that this person love love you because he he's a, a, a athletic, you know what I'm saying? He a superstar. He plays sports. Nine times a team, you find a lot of rappers, people play football, basketball. It's very few that ain't going, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, step on their marriage. You feel what I'm saying? But nine times a team, it's a lot of athletes, you know what I'm saying? Trust me. They be playing they fear. You hear me? So, you know what I'm saying? Don't don't always draw your attention towards a married man. Don't always draw your attention towards somebody that's got money. You feel what I'm saying? That's when that's when you lose a side of you because you paying attention to, you know what I'm saying, what he got. You feel what I'm saying? You ain't paying attention what he doing to this woman, to his wife. You feel me? You pay attention to what he's doing to his wife. So you should be like, hey, you should have fall back and say, no, we ain't doing that. This here ain't going to work. You feel what I'm saying? You got to use your brains. You know what I'm saying? But sometimes the young generation, man, they just they just thinking they can play the field and do what they want. And then, you know what I'm saying? And then they get the last back in. You dig it? I'm saying? I'm talking about they get the, they get all the garbage down there to the bottom. You hear me? Because, you know what I'm saying? Because you ain't doing but playing yourself. You feel what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And that dude playing himself. You feel what I'm saying? Because he got to he gotta reap that what he did. He going to reap that. He going to reap it God way. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? So, that dude, man, he just, he don't, he, he know he made a mistake. You feel me? Because you see how he look in that picture. Like, he really ain't want to take that, that pick. You dig what I'm saying? He, he ain't want to take that pick. You dig what I'm saying? That dude, he was looking like, you know what I'm saying? That was, that one of them smiles like, hey, man, I should never took no pick with her. You feel what I'm saying? Because you know, women's how women's feelings is more easy to hurt and than men's. You feel what I'm saying? People have so much, like, weak when it come down to love. Uh, either something happened in their house and they don't know what love is or they don't know, you know what I'm saying, how... You know what I'm saying? To love they self first. You feel what I'm saying? You love yourself first. You won't put yourself in this position right here. You feel what I'm saying? You won't let a man eat a woman. You feel what I'm saying? Finesse you to doing wrong. You feel what I'm saying? Furthermore, you won't mess with a married man. You feel what I'm saying? And a man won't mess with a, a married woman. You feel what I'm saying? It's going to be told up to you. You feel me? And I stand on no business about that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know I'm speaking the truth. So like my video. You know what I'm saying? So you know... On that note, you dig what I'm saying, my good people? You know what I'm saying? Life life is a gamble. But when you dating a married man, you know already it's a gamble right there. You feel what I'm saying? So there ain't going to be no screen attached or nothing like that. I don't care if you do got a, you know what I'm saying, a, a baby by this dude. You feel what I'm saying? He just there for the have fun. You feel me? He just there for, you know what I'm saying, get his mind off certain things that what he going through inside his crib with a significant other. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Ladies, you got to pay attention. You know what I'm saying? Men, we got to pay attention. You feel what I'm saying? And I stand on that. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, y'all like my video, baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to scratch that. That's all I got for y'all. You know what I'm saying? So, I hope y'all go be checking out my little short videos I got. You know what I'm saying? Appreciate it. Thank y'all. You know what I'm saying? Keep on doing that. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, my good people, as y'all down with me, I said, y'all down with me. If y'all were down with me, man, y'all have been on Smack That Like Button. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, my good people, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know what to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, share, comment, smack that doorbell for me, baby. You heard me? And keep God first in your mind. You know what I'm saying? I stand on that. So I'm gone, my good people. I'm gone. <laughs>